year old and he's building with Tinker Toys. Like he legitimately is building with Tinker Toys. Good morning, beautiful people. I am just relaxing in bed and someone is playing. Oh. Yes, I still have some unpacking I need to do. And some putting away of things that I need to do. But someone. You do it. You, you playing? He's playing in his room. Oh my goodness, guys. So I failed. I went shopping at Value Village this morning. Yes, I'm still in like pajamas. And yes, I went shopping like this just because I'm waiting for some delivery for today. But anyways, I went to Value Village because I have hospital tours coming up and it is business casual. And so I needed some new clothes for it. So I got these shoes which are extremely comfortable. Feels like you're walking on air for $5.99 because you need comfortable shoes when you're walking around a hospital. Um, I got a few fun shirts just for, because I haven't been shopping for myself in like forever. So I got this, which is super cute. Super cute shirt. I love it. It was $3.99. And then I got another super cute shirt. Ah! <laughs> it's not cooperating with me. And there's that one. I love the color. Z colors. And it was $2.99. And then I had to get so those two shirts aren't for the business uh, for the business casual, but these pants are. And funny story about these pants. So these are nice black slacks. They are three ninety nine. However, the purple tag today was fifty percent off. So basically, I paid like a buck fifty for the pants. Or like a little bit over back 50 for the pants. And then I got, okay, don't think I'm totally weird, but I love this. It's kind of like a fun little blazer, but it's all floral print and it was $5.99. So hold on, let me do a little, sh let me show you what it looks like on. It looks a lot better on than it does off. And yes, it's got, it even has shoulder pads, which I'm going to take out. See, it's not that bad. It looks a lot better on. So I have that and I've got some shirts that I'm going to, that I am able to wear underneath it that are extremely cute and they match the exact colors. Like I have a pink one and a peach one that would match that floral print perfectly. Just, just the colors. And so since they're solid colors, I'll be able to wear it underneath that with the black slacks. And I think it would look pretty cute. That's business casual, right? <laughs> so, took the shoulder pads out. But that's kind of my plan. I've got, I'm thinking about going and grabbing another pair of pants or two and just kind of seeing more options. I don't know. Okay guys, so I just got the call. My delivery should be here very soon. I'm super excited. Yes, I'm waiting at the window because I don't know if it's gonna fit. <laughs> I am getting a, ah, uh, you'll see in a minute. <gasps> Do you see that guys? My delivery's here. I'm so excited! Ah! Now let's hope that it fits. 
Okay guys, so I have bad news. <laughs> so, this is what I was waiting for to get delivered. Washer and dryer. However, the guys that came out to install it said that that's the wrong plug. And I went and talked to my maintenance guy while they were here and he was like, no, that's, that's like an okay plug. You just need to get a converter, have them set it up fully. And the guys were like, well, we're not gonna set it up fully. That way you can just get whatever plug you want. And um, there was a little bit of an altercation between the maintenance guy and the installation crew. And um, I went out to apologize to my maintenance guy and he was like, that's it. I've had enough. I'm going and I'm buying you a correct outlet and you can just plug it in, call them back and have them come out here and fully install your dryer because they just did a haphazard job and they need to do the full job. Well, I called them back and now they're like, well, we can't come back until the 31st. So, meh. But I love my complex. Like the maintenance guys are so awesome and the complex is so awesome that they're just like, we're just gonna fix this right now and just tell them to get their butts back here and fully install your stuff for you because this is not right. They didn't wanna do it and they need to do it. So, but we'll see how this goes. <laughs> I feel bad because he's going to buy a plug right now thinking that they're gonna come back here and move this stuff for him and they're not. So we're just gonna see what happens. <laughs> Stay tuned for the saga of the washer and dryer. Well, sorry guys. Um, I haven't vlogged much more just because that saga got a little crazy. Um, they're not my... My maintenance guy is going... He went and he got this to change out the plug for me. Which... apparently is the correct plug for my dryer. However, the installation people are in so much hot water with me right now that they're supposed to make sure that my dry or that my washer drains properly and fully. Well, they were in such a rush to just be done that the entire drum of my washer was full of water and they didn't check it. So I am gonna be calling them This is what happens when Coben and Jessica stop by for like five minutes and don't stay. This right here. Anyways, so where was I? The, the people that are supposed to come and that were supposed to set it up fully didn't set it up fully. And because of that, I'm going to have to wait until the 31st to have the rest of it set up. So I'm not very happy. And I'm trying to cook dinner. <laughs> Pork chops and zucchini. Oh, is it really that bad? Okay, come here. Come here. This is what happens, Jessica. This is what happens. Do you want to try raw zucchini? Go for it. Oh, you want watermelon. You just had a huge bowl of watermelon that you didn't eat. How's dinner, baby? No? <sighs> well, so much for my rule of you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. Yeah, no. They don't want any. He's silly. You ever have those days where you wonder how you're gonna survive being a parent? Today's one of those days. Huh, we just got out of the bathtub. Mm. Yeah, to calm us down. Some lavender bath to calm us down. Yeah. Is this your new way of eating a peanut butter sandwich? With a fork? You're silly. <laughs> 
So much for that bath. He's covered in ketchup and peanut butter. Go figure. And I forgot to vlog about it, guys, but I did a little bit of a DIY today, and I kind of turned these into that to kind of match my pictures that are up there. We'll see how those turn out. I'll try and hang them up later. Yeah, you wouldn't believe I just gave him a bath, guys. My goodness. You are gross. So gross. What are you doing? Are you building with Tinker Toys? Derek. Did you get it on there? Whoa. Uh oh. Get back on there. Eric, here's the other part. Where's that go? Good job. Let me push it on. Good job. Guys, he's a year old and he's building with Tinker Toys. Like, he legitimately is building with Tinker Toys. Turn it around. Put it in there. They're closed, by the way, so he cannot hurt himself. <coughs> Catch your toes! <laughs> You're such a smart baby. <laughs> Okay guys, well my battery is blinking red, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap up today's vlog. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Go ahead and subscribe if you're not subscribed already, and we will see you next time. Bye!